Kevin and I are going to be trying three of eggs from the Cold Stone Creamery. That's the easiest way to say it. Um, Andrew was in Walmart, the done guy, and he saw these and he picked these up for us. They were five dollars each. Uh, these are Cold Stone Creamery and there are three different flavors. So, this one is Funky Fun Fudge. Chocolate covered fudge cream egg with cashews and caramel. That's so, good. And then this one is Rainbow Cakery. Chocolate covered cake batter cream egg with rainbow sprinkles and cookie dough. And this one's the Peanut Butter Madness. Chocolate covered peanut butter cream egg with brownie bits. So we'll tell you about calories and all that as, as we go. I think we should try this one first. That's the cake okay. one? Yeah, because I think we try to do the plainest flavor, what we think is going to be the plainest flavors to the um, uh, biggest flavors. And um, Use the cakes, please, Blaine. Yeah. And well, and it's in sprinkles, and so I don't know. I just don't expect it to be as flavorful as, like, the peanut butter, of course. So... Kevin can hold that up. It's it heavy. is a that third. Is a dense, dense, heavy. That's heavy. It's huge. heavy a thing. It's though. huge. Oh gosh, that is a very heavy. That is how big it is. Very big, and it it is quite heavy. It yeah. is uh, six ounces. Um, a third of the package are two hundred forty calories. There are three servings in the package. So it's about, uh, it's going to be the same amount of calories as a candy bar if you split it up three ways. Now, of course, you have to get 57 grams exactly, and we were not going to sit here and try to get exactly 57 grams because then Kevin said, you know, I would be cutting slices off just to get it to that exact Yeah, shaving weight. and shaving and Because shaving. I was going to try to weigh these out for you, and it's just not worth it. So you showed how pretty yeah, that is? Yeah, like That's very have. pretty, actually. Sorry, he was getting a drink of water. Mm. Mm. A lot of cream. That mm -hmm. is so sweet. You couldn't eat that whole thing. It tastes like a like a cream candy, like Divinity or something like that. Mm -hmm. I like vanilla, very thick cream. The cream actually has a little bit of the sugar uh, pieces in it. You can kind of taste them with your teeth. To me, or feel them with your teeth. It tastes like the um, center part of a Cadbury cream egg. Is that thicker? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can believe that because yeah. it's a vanilla. Yeah, it's yeah, just really, like really the good. center of a cat. So if you're looking at that rainbow cake room, the center of a Cadbury cream egg, but it's thick, it's not runny. So it's that's really, really good. <laughs> that's really good. I like that. Um, I'm telling you, these are so rich. I couldn't eat a third of that. I think yeah, so. <laughs> I don't think I could eat a, a third. You know, like a candy bar, it's no problem, but that is so sweet. Okay, what is this one? Uh, fudgety, fudgety fun fudge. Fudgety fudge. You just wanted me to say fudgety. I will get it open at some point. Okay, I'm going to read about it. And it is, it's funky fun fudge. Oh, funky, sorry. He made it so much harder, fudgety fun fudge. Fudgety fun. Fudgety fun. It's, fudgety fun. This is still a huge heavy egg. I mean, that's heavy. Funky Fun Fudge. Funky. Chocolate covered fudge cream egg with cashews and caramel. It's uh, 57 grams. It's 240 calories. So it's the exact same calories. The one that has different calories is going to be the next one. It's the peanut butter, of course. Um, so it, this is 240 calories for a third. And there are three servings in the package. Let me see if I can focus. Oh, yeah. You can see how thick and dense that is. Here you get that one. That's got a nut. There, there are some nuts all through it. I definitely see. Um, did you show it? Did it show mm -hmm. it? Cashew. Mm -hmm. it's going right on the top. Same really thick consistency. Very sweet. Very rich. Um, That's fudge. It's good. It's it's got a fudge flavor, but it's not a really strong, like super overpoweringly chocolatey flavor. It's just, it's good. It reminds me of um, when we bought fudge at other places. 
like pre-made fudge at like an amusement park or something like, like that. Yeah, I was thinking like King's Island. King's Island or... Our yeah. Christmas fudge isn't true fudge. Right. This is true fudge. Yeah, and, and but it's not very strong. I don't think it's a really strong flavor to you. I mean, it's a good chocolate flavor, it's but it's not like a... chocolate. Lot. Right. It's not overly a chocolate. It's no. not... Um, the cake one was much stronger flavor. Yeah, I, I, I never thought I would say that, but I like the cake one better. I did too. I Rainbow Cakery Egg. I did too. And even the nut... Uh, just because I just got, I guess, a little piece, I didn't get the strong cashew flavor. No. It, it was it's good. delicious. And if you like fudge, you would like that a lot. Um, but just as far as comparing the two, the cake one was better. It does have a tr true fudge flavor, though. And again, if you, you couldn't eat much more than a part of that because you would be sick. No, it's very uh, rich. And then the last is the Peanut Butter Madness Chocolate Covered Peanut Butter. I'm oh, amazed how heavy these things with are. With brownie bats. It's, it's like just, a monster Reese's cup or something. I mean, it's huge. <laughs> and this one, it. that one has a different uh, texture on the it's front. Smooth, yeah. It's smooth, where the other ones were um, like bumpy, or rippled. Yeah, this one is smooth. Reminds me of the Reese's egg yeah. because it's smooth. Yeah, maybe what they were going for. This one is 310 calories for a third, so a lot more calories. The other two were 240 for a third. This one is 310, so 60 more calories um, for a third. And, of course, I'm sure this one, I ex fully expect to like this one the most because um, I'm crazy about peanut butter. Okay, I can say the cream is not as thick as the other ones. Uh, the cream is a lot um, squishier or softer. More like a Reese's peanut butter cup or something like that. Mm, that's good. As far as peanut butter is so thick. <laughs> this is very good. That actually tastes like peanut butter in a chocolate egg. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah. Not like Reese's peanut butter, but like real and true peanut butter. Right. You don't like, like, a, like real peanuts. Yeah. You don't yeah. like it as well? Is that what you... No, I'm, I'm asking It's you. not super sweet. That's what I'm thinking. It No, it's delicious. It does taste to me like real peanuts uh, in a peanut butter versus like uh, Jif or, yeah. um, you know, regular peanut butters are, are very sweet. This is not... It's not very um, sweet. It's, it's delicious, uh, but I think the sweetness is coming mainly from that chocolate and not necessarily from the peanut butter. Mm -hmm. It's good. Taste it. I don't think, if, if you were to compare this with a Reese's egg, no, the Reese's is going to win. This is more like natural peanut butter. Yeah, product. this cannot compete with Reese's. No, it's just not sweet enough. No. So that's like a natural peanut butter mm -hmm. almost. Yeah, all of your sweetness, this I'm glad chocolate. I tried it that yeah. way. All of the sweetness is definitely coming from the chocolate. Yeah, the peanut butter by itself is really kind of, it's peanutty, but it's kind of bland. No, it's good too, but just know that if you want Reese's, you need to just go ahead and buy right. the Reese's. And, and honestly, these are five bucks a piece. Mm -hmm. uh, buy the cake one. The cake one by far is the best one. I was going to ask you which one you like yeah, the best. Buy, buy, I mean, yeah. not, even, not even close. Like mm -hmm. cake is up here and then the rest of yeah. them are down here. And I actually like the fudge one better than I did the peanut one. I did too. The peanut one was kind of disappointing. The peanut butter one was my least favorite too. Yeah. Just and, because... You know, I just have such a high... Well, you want that sweet peanut butter flavor, right. and it just really didn't have that sweet... Of course, how many calories would have been if it had a sweet peanut butter flavor? I or it been 500 imagine. calories or something, but... Just peanut butter alone, though. I mean, if you don't realize how many calories it has, just look at a jar of peanut butter. It oh, that's yeah, ridiculous. Of calories. So... Well, this would be a really cool... Um, you know, if you buy your kids, like, the eggs or the, the Easter bunnies, maybe your kids are a little older, maybe they're teenagers, and you still buy them something... This they would really enjoy these. Yes, they would. Um, either the fudge, the what is it called, the fancy funky fudge. It's called funky fudge. Fun. Funky fudge or the rainbow cakery. Either one of those would be good uh, for an older kid. If you mm -hmm. had like a teenager, thirteen or fourteen, they can sit here and slice this up. You could you could have this 
at Easter dinner as a freaking breakfast, as, as a dessert almost. You could, you could, because it's so big. There's huge. And I mean, yeah. I was slicing off just a little bitty slices, and I've still got a ton of it. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, because we just had one little piece yeah. each. and it was rich. So, yeah, these were delicious, and I'm grateful to Andrew. Andrew, if you're watching this video, which I know you are, uh, thank you again. Andrew can't eat any of this right now because he's on a diet, so he's giving it all to us so that we can gain weight while he loses weight. Yeah. So, uh, but no, we really appreciate it a lot, and these are delicious and fun to eat. Except for the peanut butter. <laughs> it's still good. No. It, it's just real peanuts. It's not as good as the other ones. So, uh, thanks for watching.